look in the door, Miguel. I'm afraid. Hey, I have to find Charity. What are you so afraid of? What's my call? What is it, Miguel? It's empty. Empty? No clothes? Yeah, but I, I was hoping Charity might be inside. Well, we searched the whole house and she's not here. Where would she be? She's dead. What are you talking about, Kay? She's dead. She, Charity's dead. She's dead. We're never going to see her again. What's wrong with you? Charity's dead. Kay, snap out of it. You're not making any sense. What makes you think Charity's dead? I, I, I don't know. I, I, I don't know what I'm saying. I'm sorry. I'm, I guess I'm just a little freaked out because she's gone. Why'd you say she was dead? I don't know, Jess. I just said I was freaked out. Okay. Don't worry about it. All right? I know you did your best to keep an eye on Charity while I was at the party. Nobody's blaming you. Wait a second. Maybe she went to the Crane Mansion for the party. Think so? Sure, you know, I was going on about how great the party was and how I, I wish she was there with me. Maybe she decided to go and surprise me. What do you think? Could be right. I'm going to call over there and talk to Luis. Maybe he's seen her. Call over and help us. What are you doing here? Well, I wanted to let you know. I tried to fix the machine, but no go. Here we go. Reese, on your way over here, did you happen to see Charity? Uh-uh. Why? She's missing. I'm afraid she went to sleep. Wow. Never a dull moment at the Bennett house. You know, I thought my machine picked up on some evil around here. What machine? Well, I invented this machine to suck up all the negative psychic energy after all the weird things that have been going on. Right, with, like, with the birds and then the blood on the wall. It's just been too bizarre. Well, that's why I invented it. This stupid thing tanked. Well, look, there's got to be some explanation for why those things happen. All right, but right now, all I want to do is find Charity. Come on, Reese, you can help me. Look, we're going to search the neighborhood. I'm going to go, too. You coming, Kay? Um, actually, no. I think I should stay here, just in case she comes back. Right. Good idea. Let's go. And we looked all over the neighborhood, but there's no sign of her. It's like she just disappeared. <sighs> This is really creeping me out. Well, we'll just check Charity's room. Maybe she left a note. Well, we can look again, but I didn't see anything. Okay, she didn't come back, did she? No, I was hoping you'd found her. Well, does it smell like sulfur in here? I will let this guy be! I will let this go! There was a fire in here. No, there wasn't. Oh, I mean, Charity thought that she saw a fire in here. Louise. Charity had a vision of the fires of hell and, and souls of the damned calling out Nagany in her closet. What? Yeah, well, she must have just been having a bad dream. So, uh... Wait a minute, what? What's this? Looks like scorch marks. That's what it looks like to me, too. Scorch marks? Like, what, there really was a fire here? That's exactly what they are. But, no, that's impossible. I mean, she really dreamed about a fire. Well, apparently she more than dreamed about it because these marks prove that there was a fire here. Kay, you were here when Charity said she saw the fire. Why didn't you say anything? And why, why didn't you tell us it was a real fire? What do you know about this?